Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and this is Sonali from It Starts at Home and today I'm sharing you our dino book. It's a random book that I have and uh, it's like plain pages all like totally pale plain pages and I got a couple of um I got a couple of minutes uh, the other day and what I did was I just made few activities for Vivan and these activities are just impromptu they are not based on any uh, like all my brain teaser activities or anything uh, this is basically if you have a notebook and if you're free what all you can do in like an hour's time so let me share with you quickly okay so going forward um, I have just written his name and like stuff and then um, the activities are basically what he's doing right now and what he can uh, do in a couple of uh, weeks and um, all basically uh, uh, within his curriculum so if you can see i have done the first one is addition with the number um, with the place value and where i have given him uh, two different numbers and he needs to add on and write the answer here so the first page is on place value addition uh, the second one is he needs to rewrite again four uh four and four one and one three six and ten and five uh i just told you i mean i haven't planned this so whatever was coming in my mind i was just just like just doing it so here he has to write edges and vertices and along with another pen colored pen he will be marking all the edges uh then another one we have a add up uh, thing here and this is something that i do with Vivan a lot i like i randomly take my plain books that I, I generally use and I make the whole book on addition or subtraction and that's what he does whenever he gets time. Uh, I haven't recorded my addition book video. I think I should do that because this really helps them to add up and think in the brain and count and write. Then I have bring back the runaway number. So you have 100 plus and there is a dash and there is 150. So he needs to find the number that ran away and he needs to put them back here. Uh, then some more addition with a uh, single digit and uh, three numbers back to back right here and he needs to add and he needs to write it here. Then we have a domino addition. So you can see there are a lot of maths uh, going on right here. So you have subtraction here and I also write like less, reduce, take away and remove so that he's, he always remembers that what is subtraction and the words that are associated with that. So you have very simple ones, 2 minus 1, 3 minus 1, 3 minus 2, 4 minus 1. So like this, you have one set here, the, another one going on here. Then again, you have double digit uh, addition and they're not carry forward. They are simple, but just still double digit. And uh, he's going to do one set here. He's going to do another set here. Uh, then you have skip counting series right here up to seven. Uh, then you have one less so he needs to write one less of each number right here uh, the space is just right right next to it then you have before and after he needs to write the number here hmm so we are actually doing measure uh, with the scale so I have uh, use a scale and when he'll be doing this he needs to measure and he needs to write the answer in centimeters that I've already written here so he will be following that then uh, we like the clock we like we will still keep revising clock again and again so you, what i've done here is i've made the clocks and um, i've written eight o'clock so vivan needs to make the small hand at eight and the big hand at 12 and the same way he needs to make all of them here and then here the time is there and he needs to write the time so if it's like 2 30 he needs to write two then dot and then three and zero okay or he can always always tell me that this is half past two or this is half past four so he needs to tell me like that this is uh 6 15 or quarter past six so like that he needs to just um either let me know or he needs to write it right here okay so we have complete the clock and make three three o'clock so he needs to complete the clock and he needs to make three o'clock right here then I have match and it says 24 hours a.m. p.m. What is a.m. and what is p.m. And then you have 30 minutes. You have a, a minute shorthand. You have one by four, like one fourth. You have one hour and he needs to find the corresponding answer and he needs to write. He needs to match them. Uh, another one, divide the clock in four quarters because we did fractions and we did when we were doing the clock into four quarters. So we are going to divide that. 
and then you have a little bit of uh, english uh, activities right here it says language and i am a boy he needs to fill up the lines i like chocolates or i love chocolates he needs to write that i am 5 years old i like blue color or whatever color he likes and i love to whatever he likes he needs to write here then uh, there are few uh, sentent the sentences here there is a there is a trouble okay and there is something wrong when you she are a girl so he he needs to figure out what's uh, uh what's the portion that okay sorry the word that is wrong and he needs to substitute with the one of these and he needs to figure out she is a girl or she am a girl she are a girl so are is wrong and is needs to come here so he will be circling is here and so on here so these are basically tongue twisters now there are middle sounds here that are pending and uh, the alphabets are right here so he needs to fit in all these alphabets here somewhere and make them into complete full words then we have cvc uh, beginning and ending words and um, i have written the words in between vivan needs to make a word he needs to f uh, write a beginning word and an end word so that it makes a, a cvc word so i have there are seven of these then you have correct the right word so there's a bug and i read a bag and a bug he needs to figure out the spelling and he needs to write the correct word so kite and kite he needs to figure out which one and then he needs to make the right word so that's it guys this is what i just made and i have like a lot of pages but this is what i thought i have to just make so that's it guys i mean this was a very impromptu thing that i did for vivan and this is basically uh once we are back and if i don't have time to like take out the activity so this book is like always out along with a pencil and an eraser and i can't find the eraser right now sorry so this is on our dining table or generally down when we come and watch tv or when me and vivan's dad is talking and vivan wants to do something he knows that this book always has something so he can pick it up and he can very easily quickly do a certain activities uh you can you can uh make activities according to your child's age It, they don't have to be exactly what i have done but you can always alter the things the way you would want it to be so basically this is more of math and less of language uh but i definitely i'm going to add on more activities in here if you like this video give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed my channel please to subscribe and if you have any questions do let me know i will be more than happy to answer thanks for watching guys see you next time